All right, everybody. This is it. This is it. Fed Day. Uh, actually, more than that. We have a lot to talk about, so bear with me here. Uh, so, yes, it is Wednesday, Fed Day, September uh, 18th, 2019. Um, how about this? Uh, the Federal Reserve um, is recapitalizing the banks via this repo mechanism that we've all been hearing about. This is the first time this has occurred since the financial crisis. Massive capital injections into the system. Why? To prevent a credit freeze. People, look, I've been outlining for all of you for umpteen years now that we are going to face another credit freeze. That means transactions stop, no inter interinstitutional lending, the cash that you think exists in the bank disappears, ATM stop running. This is what happened. People don't remember this. In 2008, the Federal Reserve had no choice but to put forth massive capital injections into the system. Look, we are in a full blown debt crisis and the only thing that's keeping the system somewhat functional is adding more debt to a full-blown debt crisis that's what the Federal Reserve is doing right now and that's what they're going to do later today uh, the Federal Reserve has no choice but to cut rates a series of cuts uh, buy more debt to keep the system propped up Look, this is going on around the world. You all know that. We are literally living underneath the threat of a massive financial meltdown unlike anything the world has ever seen. And the only thing that's pre preventing it from happening right at this moment is the acquisition of more debt on an unprecedented scale. And all this is doing is kicking the can down the road, exacerbating the entire problem. That's all it's doing. Uh, they can't fix the situation. The situation is debt, uh, period, the end. And how are they fixing it? Well, look what the Fed is doing. Capital injections into the system to prevent a credit freeze. <laughs> Sometimes I scare myself. I mean, I've told you this for years, that we are going to face a moment of another credit freeze. This entire thing is going to correct to fair value. There's no way to stop it. Are you looking at the bond market right now? Do yourself a favor. In the description of this video is a link to my website, traderschoice.net. Right side of the page, under the chat room, go look at the bond market chart. Be forewarned, your eyeballs will explode. There is a massive amount of debt buying going on here. It's incredible. It really is, but I really want you to think about where we are at and the desperate move right now. I mean, we have not seen this since 2008. Massive capital injections into the system to keep it going, to keep the credit markets flowing. Well, what's going to happen when it locks up again? More capital injections, more capital injections, deeper rate cuts into the negative, going, you know, way into the negative around the world. And the, that means that banks are going to reach right into your account and pull cash out just to make just so they can survive. What we are going to see, people, down the line, is uh, more bank failures on an unprecedented scale. You see these big, lofty banks? You remember Bear Stearns, you know, my old home home team over there? Well, hopefully they're, they're all gone by now, most of those people. Uh, let me tell you, you know what, we're not even gonna go there. Uh, Lehman Brothers, out. There'll be more, there will be more. There is no doubt about it. The system cannot function like this. Uh, and the direct collusion between our politicians, all of them, uh, and their central banks are setting up an implosion of the system. That's what they're doing. Uh, and a massive wealth transfer on an unprecedented scale like you cannot believe. A two-tier society is already here. We don't even really have a middle class anymore. Uh, and we are going to face another moment of a, a credit freeze uh, with an inability to un to unfreeze the system, no matter how much they want to throw into the system, I'm referring to capital injections. So I want you to think about it. We are in crisis. You're not supposed to know about it. Things like capital injections into the system, things like rate cuts on a dramatic scale, like our president is talking about, zero into the negative, only happen in an economic meltdown. But you're supposed to believe 
that we're booming. Duh. Duh. You can't make this stuff up if you even try it. I swear to you, it's incredible. Stocks are about flat, at least right now while I'm doing this video. I got involved in one trade this morning on the short end at the open, and I made a few dollars there. Uh, I'm waiting to see what, what else happens later on. Again, this is huge. Uh, 11 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Uh, yeah, that'll be 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're going to get the Fed announcement. Uh, I still stick to my guns on this. We're going to get a cut. Uh, the president will not be happy with whatever he, cut we get, so expect a tweet storm or tweet risk. We can trade this, Lions, so be ready to trade it and uh, capitalize on it, period, the end. Speaking of capitalizing on things, we understand what's going on now. Capital injections into the system to keep the credit market flowing. So what does that tell you? Uh, you should have like alarm bells going off in your head. Bet against the debt. Become your own central bank. Hold gold, more specifically silver, and yes, cryptocurrencies. Bet against the debt bubble because they have no choice but to inflate it. Look, I think this video has been really important. People need to get a perspective on what's going on. Please share this video. Get it out there as far and wide as you can. I'm counting on you, especially if you're part of my team. I mean, what do we got? 93,000 people following this blog? That's a lot. All right, let's, let's make it happen. I love you all a lot, and I promise that at the end of the day, I'm going to try not to blow my stack off uh, after the Fed announcement, but uh, <laughs> we'll see how that goes, too. See you later.